Rapid Emergency Operations Center with our entire critical workforce, right on the cusp of hurricane season and also talking about all kinds of different events that could create emergencies that we need to be prepared for. And so uh, it's important for us to come together to understand that we have to uh, work together within ourselves and also with outside agencies to be well-planned and well-coordinated in the event that anything occurs uh, that could be a, a major emergency for our city. As you know, we are starting the hurricane season and uh, we gotta pray that none of, the, of those hurricanes that have been predicted will hit us. But if it happens, well, what we're doing is we're getting ready, getting all the departments ready for it. So if it happens, so we can go out and help the residents of the city of Miami and try to protect it as much as we can. We are a big city and we gotta be prepared. I'm glad I'm here to learn as a new commissioner what happens here and how we go about it if something like this uh, should happen. What we do here is beyond even hurricanes. It can deal with mass casualty events, significant events that happen to our city and the ability to sort of mobilize all of our resources. Because the only way we recover as a city is to have a well-run emergency operations center. So we're super excited about uh, today. This is our annual EOC exercise where we have all department directors, the city manager, we have some elected officials and really talk about coordination. Coordination with the city government at the time of a disaster. And it seems like it's done just casually, but in time of disaster, this is well planned and something that we rehearse and we have a, so a solid uh, game plan going into hurricane season or really any disaster that it may affect the city. We come here to our emergency operations center and we practice in our hurricane preparedness exercise. So we come here so everybody understands what is required of them for us to be able to mitigate a storm before to handle it during, and more importantly, to ensure that we recover properly and render our city safe and our citizens make sure that they're uh, taken care of after a storm. I just want everybody to know, as you can see behind me, we're ready in case something does happen.